In the red corner from Leela Lake, Texas, coming in at 241 pounds, Alex Perez. Perez. His opponent across the way from Mission, Texas, coming in at 245 pounds, Merced Solis. Solis. By the bell sounds is a referee from the National Wrestling Alliance, Mario Savolti. Asked for the bell, and this match underway here on Championship Wrestling, the all-new Championship Wrestling. And a big bear hug by Perez, but they're laying on the ropes, and Perez has to back off. Side headlock by Alex Perez as he holds on to Merced Solis, brings Merced Solis down, but he doesn't keep him there. And Solis kicks him into that head scissors. Alex Perez trying to kick out. Merced Solis holding on. Has the legs locked in there tight. As you can see, Alex Perez trying to work his way out there. Merced Solis with the pressure still on, trying to pull the head of Perez back in as Perez is coming out, trying to get the shoulders of Solis down. Will he get a count? Oh, he gets a one count. Here comes the monkey flip as he caught him off the ropes. An arm drive by Merced Solis. Merced Solis with the arm drag, holds on to the left arm of Alex Perez as Perez keeps up the right shoulder, no count. Don't be surprised if sometime during this match you might see Alex Perez throw a punch or two. He's a great boxer for seven years. He was a New Mexico State boxing champion, also Texas State uh, National AAU champion. Five times he was in the Army. He was a state Texas champion for Company H at 36th Division, so don't be surprised if he doesn't throw a punch or two. He's also known, of course, as Alex K.O. Perez. He can knock him out. You don't have to worry about that. Perez, bouncing off the ropes. He goes over the top of Solis, who had dropped down, but Solis is ready. Gets in front of High in the air, he put Perez right back to the arm drag, and Merced Solis, outguessing Alex Perez, holds on to that left arm as he's got Perez where he had him a while ago. Getting you in on Merced Solis. Merced graduated from West Texas State University, which is located in Canyon, Texas. He played football, pro football, with the Kansas City Chiefs and went on to the Canadian League, where he spent a year and a half with the British Columbia Lions up there in Canada, and he decided, well, he'd like to be a professional wrestler, and what a young, outstanding professional wrestler he is making. There's a two count on Alex Perez as Perez caught resting those shoulders there. Perez feeling the pressure as Merced Solis with that arm bar. That's all the pressure on that shoulder. Perez is up now. Very close to the ropes. I thought Alex might try to back into the ropes there to get a break, but no, it, Solis holds him in. Solis bouncing off the ropes. Oh, and Perez flips him over the knee. Perez coming back, but Merced Solis not out of it yet as he catches that arm. Takes him down. So Alex Perez probably a little mad at himself here because he thought he had things turned around where he could do a little damage to Merced Solis. But Solis come right back up with that arm drag and Perez back down on the mat. Only one shoulder touching. No count from Mario Savolti, the referee. <laughs> Solis holding on to that left arm, applying all the pressure to the shoulder and the elbow. Has a hand up on the face of Alex Perez, holding him down. Perez trying to figure it out. Would like to get up there and turn things around. Here he comes. They're standing in the center of the ring. Perez looking to see where the referee Morio Savolti is. And he grabs 
Merced Solis and slams him into the turnbuckle across the way. Perez reaches down, grabs the arm, grabs the head, takes Solis and brings him all the way across the ring into the under turnbuckle. And here goes Perez outside on the apron coming up on the rope. He is on the second rope. Solis sees him. He's got him. Merced picked him up and slammed him down as Perez had a thought about jumping off that second rope down onto Merced Solis. Solis quickly got up, grabbed Perez and threw him down and right back to the arm. Five minutes gone, scheduled for 20, or one fall. Solis holding on to that arm. Perez trying to push him off as you get a close-up look there. There's a two count as Alex Perez once again, two shoulders down. If Perez has something to say, the referee couldn't pick it up. Alex Perez once again trying to make his way up. Merced Solis trying to do the damage with a shoulder. I see Solis get Perez in a position where he can show you that beautiful drop kick that he possesses. Merced Solis can really get up in the air. A lot of pressure on that shoulder and elbow. Pro oh, Perez with a forearm. Looked like he might have wanted to throw the first punch here in this match. That's a legal blow. There's a forearm. That's another legal blow by Alex Perez. He tries to knock Merced Solis off. Seven minutes gone in the match. Perez with another forearm. Solis holding on, but that Perez got rid of him that time. Oh, and Perez come diving at him, and Solis got him with the knee. Turn him over, and there's the arm drag as Solis goes right back to what he had to control the match a while ago. Perez with some choice words for the referee, Mario Savolti, about to count. Ed Solis. Holding on to the arm of Alex Perez, and Perez resting the shoulders again, like he got caught. And a two count on him. Perez once again coming up. See how Alex Perez tries to get rid of him this time. Solis being pushed to the ropes. Perez trying to get rid of him, but Solis holds on. Said Solis holding on to that arm of Alex Perez. And we've gone eight minutes in this match. Perez coming up again. In the corner, Merced Solis in the corner. Alex Perez in front. The referee wants a break. Perez punching on the break. There's a forearm to the chest. The referee trying to get him out of the corner. Perez keeps him in the corner, comes up with another forearm. As Solis drops down to that bottom rope. Perez kicking, legal kick. The only thing you're wrong is the referee wants him to get Solis out of that corner. Forearm by Alex Perez as Merced Solis holding onto the ropes. That's what's keeping him up. Perez pulls him out to the center of the ring. And Alex Perez may be choking a little bit away from the referee. Perez lays the boots to him, knocks him down. Another kick. And 
Perez tells the referee and Laura Simbolti to get out of the way. Perez reaching in as Salik bounces him off the mat. Alex Perez begins to turn it around. Drops that knee into the back of Merced Solis. Ten minutes gone in a match. Perez picks him up. There's a punch. The referee warns him. Puts Solis across the ring. And Solis! Oh, that drop kick over the town. Here comes another one. Beautiful drop kick right on the chin of Alex Perez. He dies in there. down and takes him down for the three count and Merced Solis wins it here on Championship Wrestling. We'll be back with another one right after this.